my amazing subscribers and welcome newcomers! I am Carnage the Creator and welcome back to Survival Adventures in the wonderful world of Carnage. That's right, we are back again in the world of Carnage, ready to survive, ready to explore, and most importantly, ready to adventure! Yeah! So, in today's episode, I think what we should absolutely start out doing is finishing up what we've been working on for the last two episodes and finally just be done with it. I'm so ready to be done with the little tunnel leading down to the wolf room. So let's go see what we're going to need. I need to I need to uh, take a little bit of, a, of an estimate of what I'm going to need. Now, I do have 38 pieces of oak on me right now, so we can go ahead and use this really quick, but I do believe I'm going to need a little bit more oak. So... What we did is we extended this little little hallway section right here and then we started working on replacing all of this little this little ceiling area with oak. So this needs to all get replaced. So let's go ahead and remove this. And let's just go down the line and just start filling this all in. Now we only have 38 pieces of oak. I don't think it's going to be enough, but I think we can at least get a good bit of this done. Also, there's something that has been kind of bugging me up at the top, and I'll uh, I'll go over there in just a moment and check that out. But also, we need to fill in this hole. Hole, who said you could be there? We're going to have to go ahead and jump on. Hold on, can we do it? Can we Can we jump on? Jump on? Huh. I don't know if I'm going to get the angle. There we go. Yeah, I knew I could do it. Ha ha, in your face. Oh, I, I, I didn't need to place that there. Oops. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and... No! No, there's more gravel. Get out of my face, gravel. No one invited you to this. All right, so we're going to go ahead and throw this... Nope. Nope, not right there. That's the that's the one block I'm trying not to place it. So we're going to jump up. Boom. There we go. In your face. I knew I could do it. And now let's go ahead and continue on. Hopefully, there's no more gravel on the rest of the way down. Also, I totally just broke a torch. Oopsie dipsies. All right. So we're going to go ahead and continue breaking this stone all the way down. We're going to break this stone all the way down. I'm sure that we're not going to have enough oak. But we should be able to get at least a good bit of this done and have a pretty rough estimate of how much more we're going to need. So let's go ahead and continue breaking this down all the way down to the bottom. Also, we are going to totally have to... Oh, Gravel, who said you could get here? Uh, we are totally going to have to uh, extend this room down here a little bit. But that's not stuff that we need to worry about right this second. We just need to get all this gravel. Oh my gosh, look how much gravel. We're going to have to get in there. We're going to have to get in there to get rid of this. All right, we're going to have to place this here. We're going to have to hop on up. And we're going to have to jump on up in here. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Look at that giant, giant hole up there. So, we're going to have to place this in just like so. And there we have it. Boom. Look at that. That is looking snazzy. Uh-oh. Not right. Not right there. Why do I keep placing it in the wrong spot? So, we're going to go ahead and place it right there. Everything is looking quite snazzy. Also, I didn't finish the ceiling of this, did I? Oh, man. I still have to do that as well. That's got to be so much. Oh, my gosh. And there's more grab. Gravel, who said you could even be here? No one invited you to the world of Carnage. All right, so we're going to go ahead and hop on back up here. I guess we're going to have to place some blocks up because this is pretty high up here. Can we even? Nope, we're going to have to go even higher. Oh, no, now we can't see. All right, can we? All right, we're going to have to go a little bit higher. I can't even see right now. I'm working blind. Oh, no, that was one block too low. All right, so let's go right there. There we go. All right, so I don't know if you guys can see it, but I can see just the faintest little outline. All right, so we're going to place these down like so. And we're going to work our way down. There we have it. And we can place ourselves some cobblestone. And there we have it. There we go. That's looking great. All right. So now we can get rid of the rest of this here gravel. We can also get rid of this here cobblestone. And uh, speaking of getting rid of stuff, we also can get rid of this here piece of uh, what you call it. And we should be good to go, right? I think so. I think we're good. So I'm going to go ahead and place this down right here. And as I said, we are going to have to kind of deal with this room a little bit so uh, I'm, I'm just gonna leave it like this for now we're gonna do one thing at a time we'll have to bump that room back just by one block since we did kind of move things around a little bit but we're gonna go ahead and go all the way up with this I've got 25 left I don't know if this is gonna be enough to make it to the top but if so that would be absolutely great and we do have another side that needs doing but we did start on it so we don't we don't need that whole entire side done like this one just was so we're gonna go ahead and work our way up placing these all the way to the top Everything is looking snazzy. No, that's not where it needs to go. Get out of my face, Wood. No one invited you to get in front of my face. <laughs> all right, so we're going to go out and place this right here and place these all the way to the top. No, no one said you could be there. What have we got? Nine pieces left. And does it look like we're going to make it? it? It certainly, certainly does. Look at that. That's looking good. All right, so now that we have at least one side done, I guess, I guess, I guess that we can use these last six right here. We are gonna need to get some more no matter what, but we'll go ahead and get at least these last few put in right here. So we'll put 
one, two, three, four, and five. And then lastly, we'll get this one right here and put the last one. There we go. All right, so we don't have any more wood. We are in need of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen pieces of wood at least. However, we could get a little bit more just to be on the safe side. But back to the thing I was saying has been bothering me. I didn't realize it until I walked over here just a minute ago. So these stairs right here are right on the edge of this wood. These stairs right here are right on the edge of this wood. And these stairs, for some reason, are not on the edge of this wood. So we're going to have to bump these stairs back a little bit. We're going to put the stairs right here. Do the same thing right on over here. Put the stairs right here. Then we're going to break what we already placed. We're going to hop on over, break what we already... Wait, not those. That's the wrong ones. We're going to have to place these right back in here. And we're going to break what we already placed. And then we should be able to go ahead and patch this up with cobblestone. And look at that. That's looking right. Everything is looking quite snazzy with that. I am also going to uh, move these torches a little bit. I think I should put them right there. I think so. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see if that's going to look great. Let's, uh, let's go right on over here. Is this going to look... Is this look as good as it could look? Perhaps I should put it right here instead? I don't know. Maybe I should do this instead? Does that look right? That looks kind of right. All right, so we're going to we're gonna go ahead and break this right here. Put that right there. Put this right here. Put that right there. Break this. Put this here. Break that. And put that there. Ha! There we go. So now we've got, we've got a lot more torches. I guess we don't really need... The ones on the inside wall, but whatever. It's it's all right looking, I guess. Uh, you know what? Let's, let's get rid of them. It's looking a little bit weird. <laughs> it looked all right, but it didn't look good enough. Now, I would say, yeah, that's looking good. All right, so with that said, this is the block right after the stairs. So therefore, I can also put one right here and right here. Yeah, that's how it needed to be all along. Now we got ourselves a perfect little staircase that leads up to the top of the barn. And also, oh my goodness, it's nighttime. This is not good. We're going to have to deal with some creepy crawlies. We are, of course, on hard difficulty. So this is going to be a little tricky situation. So we're going to go ahead and eat ourselves some steak. And we're going to run on out here. And hopefully, we can make it back to our house and go to sleep before having to deal with any sort of creepy crawlies. So we're going to go ahead and open this door on up. I don't think we're going to get away with it. But we're gonna at least try it actually you know what I definitely want to beat up this zombie He's just he's just minding his own business and everything But I know he's up to something so we're gonna we're gonna beat up a zombie and then we're gonna run away So let's go ahead and go right on over here We're gonna go down the pathway and to the house and once we get into the house Hopefully there's no mobs inside of our house. That would be absolutely a tragedy We're gonna look around bandit's just hanging out right here. He's just chillaxing in the kitchen and I think we should be I'm good. I think the coast is clear. I'm looking around making sure there's got any creepy crawlies around and we can go into my bedroom and go to sleep in the bed of carnage. The triple wide bed for the coolest of the coolest kids. So we're going to go ahead and go right on over here. And um, I think at this point in time, we're going to need to go ahead and get ourselves some oak. But Bandit, I think there might be some creepy crawlies just straggling around out here. So I'm going to bring you with me on my adventure. Come on, Bandit. It's time for us to go exploring. So we're going to close our doors. We're going to close our exploring door rings. I don't know what I'm talking about. We're going to go ahead and go running right on over here. And um, up here, I think what I'm going to do eventually also is I'm going to put a pathway that's leading up to over here somewhere. I think. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But, oh, also something I've been wanting to do is remove these trees. Now, I know they look good and everything, but I need to start working on um, making this area one cohesive area. So what I've been talking to you guys about in the last couple episodes is maybe extending that tree line right there over to that tree line back there. So kind of just filling in that big giant gap right there and kind of clearing out all the trees in the little circular perimeter. So that includes these trees and I think that's what we're gonna be doing. So I think the first step would be to start clearing out the area so that we have a clear view of the uh, the outline from the, from the distance. So we're gonna start clearing out the area and that also means completely tearing down the tree farm. So we're gonna have to chop down all of these trees but we're also gonna be chopping down the entire tree farm. We're not gonna do all that in this episode but we are gonna at least chop down some oak trees right now because we do need some oak wood. So let's go ahead and get all of this oak right now. We're going to hop right on up here, grabbing all of this oak, and I think this is the last tree. I'm not 100% sure, but let's back up just a little bit, 
Is that all the trees? Did we get all the wood? Bandit, did we do it? I think we did. All right. So let's go ahead and go right on over here. Excuse me, Mr. Cow. I'm going to walk right on over here. Um, I might I might have to commandeer your uh, your flesh later and eat it because I, I might get hungry. So we're going to... I got 57 steaks right now, but I might have to put you in the bar. We'll, we'll, we'll see about that. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and go right on over here and uh, start chopping down the oak trees. Now, again, we don't need all of the different types of trees in this episode. So I'm just going to chop down the oak trees. But for the first time, I'm not actually going to replant these because I believe... It's time to move the tree farm. I'm going to do a little bit more thought. Maybe I won't do it. Maybe I'll decide to replant them. But for now, I'm not even going to worry about planting these because I'm pretty sure I'm just going to have like a nice big outline of trees. And anytime I need trees, I could just go to my perimeter of trees. So for example, let's say I need some spruce trees. I can go over there and grab some spruce trees and replant them. If I need some birch trees, I can go over there and get some birch trees and replant them. I'm going to put oak in between there and there. And then also I have dark oak over there on the side of that mountain way over there on that side. So uh, if there's any type, the only thing that I need to probably move in somewhere is some acacia. So I might need to move some acacia around somewhere so that I have close access to it. But anyways, we're going to be just pretty much getting rid of all these trees and probably decommissioning the tree farm. I'm not 100% certain on it yet. Maybe we'll use it for a little bit longer until we uh, complete the rest of our plans. Maybe that would be the smarter idea, but we'll we'll figure out over time. Also, there's a little tree over here. It's trying to try to be sneaky and another one right on way over there. You know what? We'll at least chop down this tree. I'll leave, I'll leave that tree right on over there and we'll get to that later. So we're going to at least chop down this tree right here. And then we should be good to go. We can go finish up our little um, walkway over here to the uh, to the wolf room. So we're going to go right on over here. I do have probably, yep, a full inventory. And uh, was I even able to grab any of that birch tree? Hold up. Do I not have... Oh, yeah, yeah I do. <laughs> okay, I was about to say. All right, so I think what I should do before I even go over to the barn, I should go back into the house. I should put a bunch of stuff up. And then I should go working on the stuff that I was working on. So come on inside, bandit. We're going to have you sit down right here at the bottom of the staircase. I know how you like to play on stairs, but we're not doing that today, bandit. And also on my way up, I'm going to give you a delicious treat because you've been such a good helper. And you made sure that there was, there was no creepy crawlers around. I didn't see any of them. So we're going to go ahead and start putting stuff up. I would say the first thing we need to do is put up, I would say, uh, 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 the gravel. Why now? We don't need gravel. We just get, we're getting sick of it. We're getting sick of the gravel. We'll put up some gravel on that chest. We'll put up the rest of the gravel in this chest. We could also put up a little bit of cobblestone, but I'm not going to put up all of it. So I'm going to put up this. I'm going to hang on to a stack. I might should hang on to a little bit more, but uh, whatever. We're going to just hang on to that much. Let's see. Um, over here, we have wood stuff. Do I have any extra wood stuff that I don't need? Doesn't look like it. So we're going to go right on over here. Where do I normally keep my eggs? I know I keep them somewhere. Aha! There's where I keep my eggs. So we're going to go ahead and put ourselves a chicken egg right there. Um, I guess we don't need the birch wood right now, so we could go ahead and put the birch wood in here. And also, do I see any other oak? I don't see any oak, so we're just going to let things hang out in there. Um, I guess I could also put up these seeds, this apple, and uh, that's pretty much it, I guess. <laughs> I do have two feathers, and I do have some flint. I don't have any sticks on me, but I could make some arrows sometime soon. I probably do have sticks hanging around in here somewhere. Is there any sticks in here? I didn't see any sticks. I don't know where the sticks went. So we're going to go ahead and also uh, on our way out put this chicken into our oven. And uh, I think we're good to go. I think we have our inventory cleared out enough to uh, to go back to work. So let's go ahead and go right on over here. Also, before we head on out, let's give Bandit his most favorite and delicious treat of all time. His delicious rotten zombie flesh. There you go, Bandit. Your favorite treat in the whole world. Also, we're going to see. Do we have any food in here? Nope. So we're going to cook ourselves up some chicken. Also, do we have any raw food in here? Did we cook everything? Look at that. We've cooked everything. It's all looking good. And, oh, look at that. We also have ourselves some mutton. So I'm going to hang on to this mutton. And I'm going to put it right on in there with the rest of that. Hopefully, we can eventually get ourselves a pretty decent sized stack of mutton. So, with that said, let's go ahead and go right on over here. And let's finish what we started. Bandit, when, I'm, when I walk back through here, I'll, I'll, I'll try to give you another the treat. If I can remember, I'll try to give you another treat. So we're going to go right on over here. And we're going to try to finish up what we started. Hopefully we don't have any more problems with gravel. I'm getting really sick of it. I'm getting sick of gravel falling on my head. So we're going to go ahead and go right on over here. And down we go. We also most definitely need to start digging all of this back out. Um, or actually, is this dug all the way out? Did I dig all of this out? Is this dug out far enough? But we do need to put stairs down. So um, I think I might have dug it out far enough, but I don't think 
we did the stair thing. So, okay, well, we'll figure that out later. But for now, let's at least get these blocks dealt with. So we're going to get all of this out the way. Hopefully there's no gravel. And so far, so good. Trying not to jinx it. No! No, we almost, almost had it. Man, we're so close. The gravel just had to get us. So we're going to uh, jump up here. Looks like we can looks like we can hit that block before. We've got enough skills. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I knew I could do it. All right. So now let's go ahead and chop this one down. Let's chop this one down, this one, and this one. And again, I think we only needed 13, but we got a little bit extra anyway. So let's go ahead and place these down right here. Just like so. Just like that. All the way down. All the way down. All the way down. Everything is looking quite snazzy. Look at that. And now we have the wood walls finished. That is looking great. Now we can run all the way down there. And just admire how awesome that looks. <laughs> Ignore the ceiling for now, but just admire how awesome that looks. Also, uh, you know what? We do have some stairs on us, so let's see what we could do about this ceiling. So let's see if we uh, if we did this right. So if we do this all the way down, I don't think I don't think that I left any straggling blocks. So I'm pretty sure that all we have to do is place blocks. I don't think there's any more um, any more breaking of blocks. But we're gonna go ahead and place these down, all the way down. And see how this turns out. So we're going to go all the way down just like so. All the way down. All the way down. How far? Okay. <laughs> I was to say, how far down are we? But we are very close to the bottom. So we're going to go ahead and place these like so. All the way down. All the way down. Look at that. There we go. So that's where it's going to end. The walls are going to be right here. Uh, which actually, luckily for us, we're only going to need to dig out over there. Um, and also, I could go ahead and get rid of all of this because the wolf pack is obeying. They're not running around being crazy, so they're just going to hang out right there. But I'm going to put the wall all up right here. And then I guess what I could do, I could just enclose this whole room in. I don't know. We'll figure that out. But for now, uh, look at that. The ceiling is pretty much almost done. All we need to do is one more row, and we should be good. So let's uh, go back on up here really quick. Let's bust out the crafting table, and let's make ourselves some more stairs. So let's see... How many stairs we can make here? Go right here. Let's see how many we can make. I don't know how many we just used, but we just made ourselves 51. Hopefully, that's enough to get all the way down. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't, but uh, let's see. So, we're going to go ahead and start right here. We're going to go all the way down, and hopefully, we have enough. If not, maybe we can get a little bit more cobblestone to finish it up. But this should be the walls and the ceiling completely done if this is enough. So, we're going to go all the way down here. Let's see how much further. Oh, yeah. It looks like we're going to have enough. We got 34. I'm not trying to jinx it again. I've been jinxing stuff this episode. But we're going to go ahead and place these down right here. And let's see. Yeah, we're looking good. Everything is looking fine. We're going to keep on going. I've got 22 left. I don't think I'm going to need 22 more. Nope, definitely not. Look at that. So now we have ourselves a finished ceiling. We got finished walls. We probably should do something about these torches to make them a little bit more uniform. But with that said, man, that is looking so much better than what we had before. That is a very great little tunnel. And all we have to do now is place ourselves some torches. But with that said, we can do that in the next episode. For now, we're going to go to the Wall of Carnage and see who has been added today. Also, on our way over there, we're going to give Bandit his favorite treat in the whole world. Some delicious and nutritious rotten zombie flesh. So we're going to go ahead and run right on over here. And I'm going to eat myself a steak. My hunger's down just a little bit. And we're going to run on over here and give Bandit one more treat for just hanging out and being such a good dog. So Bandit, how's it going, buddy? I'm going to give you your favorite retreat there you go buddy and we're gonna go ahead and put it up and away we go to the wall of carnage let's see who has been added today so we're closing this up joining us today on the wall of carnage is ashley martin so congratulations ashley on getting added to the wall of carnage now remember guys if you want to get added to the wall of carnage all you got to do is leave some comments down in the comment section below and i'll be choosing one lucky person each and every episode to add to the Wall of Carnage. But with that said, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. And if you did, be sure to go ahead and click that like button. And if you are one of the first 200 people to like this video, let me know down in the comment section below. But I've been Carnage the Creator. Catch you guys in the next video. And I'm out. Carnage the Creator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're watching Carnage the Creator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're watching Carnage the Creator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're watching Carnage the Creator. Creator, Creator. Yeah. yeah.